It's a very surreal experience. I mean, as you could see, I got a little emotional, a lot emotional. So, and it was like even watching the series back myself, I it was a nostalgic kind of like wow that like it, it brought up the feelings of what was happening in that current time. But like to really even more of the emotional side of like wow, I have like really evolved so much since then. So it wasn't like a sad cry. It was more of like a I'm proud of you. I don't. I can't marry you. Um. And I hope that you can appreciate that and respect that decision of mine. I had a moment with my mom. And so I spoke to it, you know, while we were all together as a group. But you know, that was a lot of stuff all coming together at once. And, and so my fears of, you know, I don't know, embarrassment, my fears of, uh, you know, like I had stressed or disappointed someone and, and kind of almost like, almost embarrassment. Like I'd brought people into something that I was clearly frustrated with uh, because it wasn't what the perception was, right? And so you know, we had been committed to you know, seeing the experience through, but what's not shown is that like she and I had conversations multiple times, also with the cameras recording, like we're adamantly not gonna get married. Like that was, that's actually, that was never, that was never something that we were gonna do. Uh, you know, and so much so that we were both calculated in the, in the manner of, you know, even when we had an engagement, it's an experiment. We're just doing the best we can to follow along with it. So we had a you know, conversation the day prior to the engagements of, we both know what tomorrow is. We both have appreciated this experiment. If you understand that, like if you hear me, you know, are you okay with what happens tomorrow? Like basically, let me preface, like before I look like an absolute crazy person <laughs> and, 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 and you know, propose through a wall, which is just you know, absolutely crazy, um, it is. Uh, I just wanted to make sure that we were both seeing eye to eye, right? Like we hadn't get lost in the cosmos that, that, it, that was the, uh, the show. And so we didn't, and that, that allowed us to get to the next step. Uh, you know, we appreciated obviously the experiment from start to finish. You know, being in Cancun was super fun, mm -hmm. uh, and and we'll always have those memories, right? And that's that's what life's all about. Had you guys yeah. been in touch since the show wrapped? Very seldom, honestly. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, I actually reached out probably about four months ago, yeah. and it was more of a it wasn't even about if the show comes out, right? Because because that was a hypothetical that existed from the moment that we stopped filming. Mm -hmm. uh, a lot of people wouldn't understand that either, but like from the moment we stopped filming, all of our friends, all of our family now is like. Let, give us, you know, the two month, three month span where all you wanted to do was just disconnect and get back to reality. Everything was changed. Everything was different. And so it took months for us just to get settled. And so you know, that was a conversation that we had that no one know. It was like, I respect your space. You respect my space. I need to get back to you know my core values, my friends, my family. And, and you know, I, I think it'd be a good, good idea if you do the same. And so we really respected that. Uh, you know, I personally didn't date uh, for the you know seven eight months afterwards, uh, but you know, a lot of life changes happened between then, uh, and so it's just <laughs> that's that's just kind of how it went. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I did go through more of a serious-ish relationship or dating, I guess, um, but that was probably a good six or seven months after the fact. I'd gone on a couple of dates, but I like I was very much set in the like I remember going on a date and I was like, listen. I've been there, done that. I'm not fixing anyone anymore. So like, if you're yeah. not ready, this ain't gonna work. 